Good afternoon. We do have some breaking news. A car crashed into a utility pole moments ago in front of one of our news crews. Brenna Waters was there and joins us live now from Pike Street in Cannonsburg with more on what happened. Brenda. Hi, Susan. While we're working on one story, my photographer and I, another one happens right in front of our eyes. Now, if you can get a look at this, this telephone pole is kind of dangling in the middle of Pike Street here at Hutchinson. The person who plowed into that pole was driving a Nissan that's sitting on that tow truck over there right now. Now, Haley and Bobby Joe were in a car about to cross the intersection. Come on over, guys. About to cross the intersection, and you kind of waited because you had the green light, but you waited, you said. Yeah, I saw him coming really fast up the road, and he sideswiped the guy's car and hit the pole. And I thought the pole was going to come through our windshield and hit us. Um, it just happened so fast, and I decided not to go when I saw his car flying down the road. Thank goodness you didn't. Yeah. It had to be scary for both of you to see that pole dangling there. Um, yeah, I basically look up and see this car crashing through a pool and see my life before my eyes, thinking we're going to get sideswiped. So it always pays to kind of stop and look before you go into the intersection, even when you have that green light. Absolutely. Okay. Did you see the guy who was driving the car? Did you talk to him at all? Yeah, I saw him um, when I got out of the car. Um, I'm not sure his status. Mm -hmm. um, okay. I, I'm not sure if he was right. drinking or not, but it appeared that way. Okay, thank you so much. Glad you guys are safe. I did talk to a police officer who was here at the scene. The person who was driving the car who did hit the pole was taken to the hospital. He was injured. I don't know the extent of his injuries, but uh, the police officer said he told him he was distracted. We don't know how he was distracted, but he did say that he was distracted. Reporting live here in uh, Cannonsburg, Brenda Waters, KDKA TV News.